Hey, you repeat after me! I don't know what I've been told! I don't know what I've been told! Bobby is the way to go! Bobby is the way to go! So this year, we have approximately 805 delegates. Our normal number is 1,000. It's down this year because of COVID. They are sponsored by local American Legion posts. We do not have an application process. Delegates must be nominated by their schools and selected by a local sponsoring American Legion post. Toward the middle of the week, we have the opportunity to elect all our state constitutional officers. Uniquely in California, the top two vote getters, regardless of party, make it to the runoffs to the general election. And in this uh, election cycle, we had two candidates from the Federalist Party that made it to Secretary of State. So we are getting to experience in real life what could happen at the statewide level here in the state of California. I am the uh, counselor for the Federalist Party, uh, but for me, this is uh, a homecoming. 31 years ago, I was uh, governor of Bo elected governor of Boys State uh, and had the opportunity to go to Boys Nation from the Federalist Party. So it's really nice to see this full circle. So now we're trying to uh, diversify the platforms within which uh, these young men uh, can campaign. Uh, we use a Slack channel so that they can put out messages that way. Uh, they produce videos. Uh, they do uh, other, uh, provide candidate statements. We try to simulate as much as possible how campaigning is. And then there's obviously the hand-to-hand -hand retail politics of campaigning right before uh, meals and asking people for their vote. Uh, there's nothing like that personal contact between two individuals. And uh, whoever did the hardest work will hopefully be the successor. So there is a, a way uh, that we've been able to manage uh, having electronic voting here uh, at California Boy State. Uh, in the past, it was done on paper, and there was a lot of uh, hands that uh, saw the ballots and a uh, process that was pretty extensive. Now the results are uh, almost instant instantaneous, and, uh, and they're secure. Uh, each um, boy logs into their account and is able to cast their vote. So in a few minutes, we're going to have the reveal of the election results. Uh, the statewide candidates, uh, the party uh, secretaries, the party chairman, uh, the councillors will all reunite with the, uh, unite rather, with the um, uh, councillors related to elections, uh, where they'll make an announcement as to who the winners are and, and who uh, are the ones that didn't make it this time around. And uh, tonight, we'll have an inaugural program where each candidate uh, now candidate elect will have the opportunity to be sworn in. The state legislature was sworn in yesterday so that tomorrow night when the governor takes office he will have bills waiting on his desk to sign or veto. The legislature is is a two house system, a state assembly and a state senate and they've already started working on bills and those that pass will be waiting for the governor and that will continue until Friday when the program ends. Thankfully I had an amazing amazing campaign committee and an amazing amazing people who were behind me. I am a great man but a great man has people have greater people behind them and they helped me they helped me see my vision through. These people without these individuals I wouldn't be here right now because I am for the people by the people.